Peter Ducey today on this same uh, same plane asked Saki why vaccinated people cut three need to wear a mask. Roll that, G. On the CDC guidance, why did the president say, if you've been fully vaccinated, you no longer need to wear a mask? Let me repeat, if you are fully vaccinated, you no longer need to wear a mask. If it was possible that that was going to turn out not two months ago. Well, Peter, I think we're all dealing with an evolving virus uh, where there's no playbook and no historic precedent. And what the American people should feel confident in is that we are going to continue to be guided by science, look at public health data in order to provide new guidance if it's needed to save lives, protect the American people. When he made those comments back in May, uh, we were dealing with a very different strain of the virus than we were uh, than we are today. And Delta is more transmissible. It's spreading much more quickly. It was nearly non-existent in the United States back in May. And so my last one would be, you guys have been saying this is a pandemic of the unvaccinated. If that is coming from the CDC, is the president satisfied with the leadership at the CDC right now? The president is satisfied uh, with the fact that they are continuing to look at public health data uh, and give pr provide public health guidance to the American public about how they can protect their lives and the lives of loved ones around them. And if it's a pandemic of the unvaccinated still, then why do vaccinated people need to put the masks back on? Well, Peter, first of all, I would say again, just to go back to this chart, which I will handily point to again, if you were vaccinated, if you were vaccinated, your life, it can save your life. And I think the clear data shows um, that this pandemic is killing, is hospitalizing, is making people very sick who are not vaccinated. That can still continues to be the case, uh, regardless of what the mass guidance looks like. If the vaccines work, which this sign says that they do, then why do people who have had the vaccine need to now wear masks, the same as people who have not had it? Because the public health uh, leaders in our administration <laughs> have made the determination based on data that that is a way what to data? make sure data. they're protected, their loved ones are protected, uh, and that's an extra step given the transmissibility of the virus Pick three, that, people, uh, that they're advising people to take. Pick three. <laughs> She's not telling the truth. Daily new confirmed COVID-19 deaths per million people. What you see on the far right is where we are now. This is a rolling seven-day average. Deaths are not up. This is not killing. We are not on any way, shape, or form on some uptick on deaths. None whatsoever. We're at the actually one of the lowest points we've ever been. If you look at this chart, this is out today. So all this alarmism about the Delta variant that she's spewing from there is nothing but lies.